Hello everyone, and now, in my opinion, Sea of Thieves is still one of Rare's most underrated games ever. I still very much love Sea of Thieves, and, like, it, it's still a fantastic game, and in my opinion, it's one of Xbox's best games ever, that they have ever made. And I also think it's one of Rare's, like, most underrated games ever. Now, I already made a defense video a long, long time ago. Talk about why I love Sea. I talk about Sea of Thieves, defending Sea of Thieves, and th t today I kind of want to talk a little bit more about Sea of Thieves. But I, uh, in my opinion, Sea of Thieves is the most underrated rare, like game from rare. And in my opinion, it's very much because of the fact that it's not a platformer. In my opinion, a lot of people, and like I, I see this all the time. I see like. In my opinion, a lot of people, they just want Rare to make another platformer. Whether that be Banjo or uh, Conquer's Bad Fur Day. They just want another platformer. And in my opinion, a lot of the hate for Sea of Thieves really comes from Rare not doing that. It's the fact that Sea of Thieves is not a platformer. And Sea of Thieves is a... Sea of Thieves is a adventure pirate game. Now, me personally, I'm not... I've never really played... Banjo or Conker's Bad Fur Day. I'm not really a big fan of platformers. I like Mario or Sonic, but I'm not a fan of platformers really. But like I, I love Sea of Thieves. I love Sea of Thieves, and I I really do think it's very underrated. I think it's underrated. I really think it's overhated for no reason. And honestly, in my opinion, I, I do think a lot of hate comes from the fact that this game is not a platformer. And I know there's a lot of people out there, they want Rare to just make another platformer. I, I see all the time people asking them to make another Banjo. Honestly, in my opinion, I don't think... In my opinion, the reason Rare hasn't made another Banjo is... I don't think they want to. I don't think Rare wants to. And I think that's clear just because how much work they have done with Sea of Thieves. Like, Rare has put so much resources and time... Into Sea of Thieves, making sure that it's the best that it can be. That, in my opinion, it kind of shows that they don't want to make another platform. They don't want to make another Banjo game. They don't want to make another Con like Conker's Bad Fur Day. They want to make what they want to make. And I know there's people out there, they're saying they are wanting another game. Like, another Banjo game and wanting a platforming, platforming game. And like, I know there's people out there saying, like, give yeah, platforming games, that way like, Xbox can have a kid-friendly game, but in my opinion, Sea of Thieves is very much that game. And Sea of Thieves is still very much underrated. I still very much love it. And I I do think everyone needs to play it, because I think it's Xbox is one of my, the best Xbox games ever. And I, I think very much people need to accept that. I don't think Rare's going to go back to platformers. And, like, I, I just don't think they're going to go back. And the next game that they're making, like, what is it called? Everwild or something? I don't remember the name of it. I feel like that game's going to get hate on it because it's not a platformer. And there's people who, they only see Rare as a plat as people who made platformers doing it in 64 era. And that's it. And it's not Microsoft's fault. It's not Microsoft's fault. In my opinion, it's just Rare doesn't want to make these games. They want to make something like Sea of Thieves. And I'm fine with that because I love Sea of Thieves. So I just want to make a quick I just wanted to make a quick video talking about this. And and I also just want to say go play Sea of Thieves. It's a really great game.